All right. This is an email from Jay. And Jay says, my question relates to exercise and recovery. I was on a restricted diet for about a year, but at no point while I was restricting did I experience the exercise compulsion that some people with anorexia endure. However, now that I'm not restricting my food intake, I find it very difficult to sit still, and I feel the urge to exercise to compensate for my sudden increase in calories. I've never been a person that has enjoyed exercise, and when I was restricting, I was always too tired to even consider working out. Do you think this sudden urge to exercise is just my body's response to more energy, or do you think it's a new compulsion with my eating disorder? I've heard you say that people should avoid exercising while in recovery, but that is that only for people that experience the exercise compulsion with active anorexia? I do find myself bargaining with food, like as long as I did work out, I can eat X, Y, Z, but if it reassures my anxiety, I'm not sure it's detrimental to my recovery to indulge in this sudden urge to exercise. <sighs> All right, Jay. So you said that you don't like exercise. You said that you've never liked exercise. And you've said that it's only since you started eating more food in recovery that you've started to exercise. So I think it's pretty safe to conclude that your desire to exercise is actually all about reducing the, like negating the calories that you ate, isn't it? That's just, that's what it's about. So if that's the reason that you're exercising, then of course it's not right. It shouldn't be about, oh, I'm allowed to eat this if I exercise. That's restriction. That's, it's the same thing as restriction. So all that happened, Jay, is you stopped restricting and you started exercising so that you could maintain some form of energy deficit. And yeah, I get it. It makes your anxiety better if you exercise. But the reason it makes, the reason the anxiety is there is fear of weight gain. And so your anxiety, feel, you feel better if you do something that might negate any weight gain that may or may not happen from whatever it was that you ate. So yeah, of course it reduces your anxiety. Does that mean that you should be doing it? No, because what you should be doing is working on what the source of that anxiety is. And the source of the anxiety is fear of weight gain. And so if you respond to fear of weight gain thoughts by exercising, what you did by exercising you said, yes, brain, you're absolutely right. I should absolutely not gain weight and I'm going to do something here to negate the possibility of me gaining weight. So you further taught your brain that weight gain is a bad thing. If you want the anxiety to go away, you have to teach your brain that you're not afraid of weight gain because it's fear of weight gain that causes the anxiety. So we have to attack that fear of weight gain. The way that you teach your brain that you no longer need to be afraid of weight gain is you have to stop acting as if you're afraid of weight gain and exercising after you've eaten to make yourself feel better about what you've eaten is not gonna teach your brain that you're not afraid of weight gain, it's doing the opposite. So what you need to do is when you start to feel that anxiety, which is that anxiety, it's just your brain doing its job. Your brain is going like, well, you taught me that weight gain is a bad thing and now you just ate a load of food. So we need to do something about this. That's what your brain's doing. And so you've got to be like, no brain, actually, you know that shit that I told you, that I taught you about, that weight gain's bad. Well, that's wrong. And now we're doing something different. So I'm actually going to eat more food because I'm hungry and weight gain is not something I'm afraid of. And even if you are afraid, because you will be afraid of weight gain, but you're still gonna act as if you're not. So your brain's gonna be like, but, 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 are you, are you crazy? And you're gonna be like, brain, it's okay. We've got this. We are no longer afraid of weight gain. In fact, I'm going to eat a donut to prove it to you, brain. And then you eat the damn donut. donut. And your brain's just gonna go like, all right, you've lost your shit. This is absolutely wild and crazy and I wanna leave. And you're just gonna be like, brain, sit me down, take a seat. I'm going to eat another donut just to show you how much I'm not afraid of weight gain. And that's how it carries on. You do not at any point go, yes, brain, you are absolutely right. I'm going to go out and run a couple of miles now. No, you sit your ass down, you chill and you get a milkshake. Okay. So to answer the question, yes, you need to stop exercise. Hope that helps. Bye.